You are looking at a replica of the Titanic made out of 75,000 wow, toothpicks. Huge. The ship is 10 feet long, Robin, and was created by local artist Wayne Cousy. It took him five years to build the ship, which is now on display at a museum in Florida. How do you transport that? Wow. Oh, so many questions. Yes. Uh, Kusi has created dozens of pieces using millions of toothpicks, including a toothpick stop Whoa. motion rock and roll band called Wood Zeppelin. Yeah. Among other things, Wayne Kusi is with us this morning. How you doing, hey, Wayne? Wayne? I'm doing okay. How about you? It's doing all right. So, how did this all start? I hear you're you use like pliers and other tools to kind of make the toothpicks more pliable, right? How how do you even do that? Uh, basically, you just take wire cutters and then kind of like score and curve them. You know, you know, you're know, you not exactly breaking the toothpick, but you're bending it with mm. a plier. And you do it in enough segments to create like a circle. Oh. This video we have of you looks like you're, you're 12 years old <laughs> that we have of you. How long have you been doing this? Uh, I've been doing it since I was uh, 12 years old, actually. <laughs> <laughs> Hey, Wayne, you know, unlike the 70s, you really don't see guys walking around with toothpicks on the, in their mouths uh, these days. Where do you find all these toothpicks? Well, I had some donated to me by, uh, by a school in Roselle, about a million toothpicks. I think it was like a math project. Wow. Uh, yeah, gone wild. <laughs> and, and you do research. You're not just winging it here. Talk about the research you do to get this right. Okay, well, I look at look up deck plans, blueprints, if I can find a plastic model of the ships I'm working on, then I'll, I'll do that. But I try to keep it as close as to the real thing as I possibly can get, or as Sutex can get. Huh. I, I, it looks like you're rubbing Elmer's glue on each individual toothpick. Please tell me th that you don't have to do that for every toothpick. Uh, yes, uh, I, I put them on every toothpick, but I use type on, type on three now. <laughs> a little, wow. little bit strong. Huh. But, what would that, if, if you wanted to sell a piece of art like the Titanic, what, what would that go for? Have you sold any pieces? Oh, yeah, yeah. I sold the Titanic for about, uh, 15,000. And, hmm. uh, and I also do commission work. What you see there in front of you, that's, uh, that's the SS Algonquin. That is a uh, commission piece I did for the village of Valgan. Wow. So it takes, the Titanic took you five years, right? How, I mean, is that the average length of time for one of these big projects? Well, the Titanic took about a year and a half. Oh, because geez, it, got that wrong, sorry. Feet long, but the, uh, the, the Queen Mary is the 25 foot model. That took about, that took about five years. Wow. wow. Are you working on anything now? Uh, yes, I'm working on a, uh, on a yacht for somebody in Florida. Nice. Actually. What about Wood Zeppelin? Tell me about Wood Zeppelin. Uh, Wood Zeppelin is a toothpick rock band animation. <laughs> uh, basically, I decided, you know, after seeing the uh, stop motion video there, that maybe I can build a band out of toothpicks and kind of like open up some new doors for me. All right. So is this your full-time job or do you, is this like your hobby on the side, Wayne? Uh, it's, it's, it's always been a hobby on the side. I'm a web developer by trade and a, and a programmer. And uh, the, the two kind of go together because you're taking little things and making bigger things out of it. Wow. wow. Have you ever thought of moving on from the medium of toothpicks into something else? Well, I could go into popsicle sticks, but I'm sure that uh, my neighbors would want to kick me out of the neighborhood. <laughs> Is that because you'd be eating too many popsicles, or you think the the, the art fixtures would get too large? Uh, I think the art pieces would get pretty pretty large. I, I <laughs> well, Wayne, keep up the good work, and uh, keep keep sending us your Wood Zeppelin animations. We love uh, showing them on the air. I'm gonna have one soon for you. All, All right, right, thanks, Wayne. For more, you can check Thank out you. WayneCousy.com. Marcus, you interviewed him years yeah, ago, huh? Yeah, CLTV on the old Metro Mix show that I worked wow. on before I came over here to WG. It's All a great right. guy. It's great to see that 25-footer still hanging around yeah. there. You know, Man. hasn't broken apart or anything like that. That is cool stuff. Yeah, check out WoodZeppelin.com. Uh, talk to you later, Wayne. Good to see you, Wayne. Thank you. Thank you. Take care now. Bye-bye. Bye-bye.